Hey Aphrodisiacs, it's me Khadija. So if you're new to my channel, then please hit that subscribe button. And if you're ready to subscribe, then welcome back. You guys, today is the day. I'm not going to be straightening my hair, but I am going to be blow drying it for the first time. I have never blow dried my hair. I've straightened my hair one time back in 2013, but how I actually got to that was I roller set my hair first and then I straightened. I just never wanted to go through that whole process of using the tension method and the chase method, whatever method it is to straighten your hair. I just never wanted to do that to my hair. And I'm actually glad I never did that because finding out later on down the line that I have fine high porosity hair, I'm sure that would have been really unhealthy for my hair anyways so you know we've come to here 2019 and there's this new device that's out right now you guys have probably heard about it and I feel like without even using it that it is going to replace traditional blow dryers at least in the salon because it's like a salon quality device it is an investment it's pretty expensive but it's something that I feel will make blow drying and straightening your hair really really easy now this brand is called Rev Air and they were so kind to give me this device so this is what the rev air base looks like and it has an on and off switch at the top also on the side of the base we have the tension settings which goes from one to seven and also we have the rev air wand which is where your hair goes inside and this has the heat settings high low and cool so we also came with the device with some Rev Air accessories. We have a Mr. Bottle, some scrunchies, some clips, a turban, and also a holder for your wand when you're using it. I'm just ready to do something different to my hair, you guys. I really wanted to blow dry my hair and do a flexi rod set. So what I'm going to do now is just take this turby twist off. And now my hair is very damp. But it does need some more water. So since my hair was drying up, I'm just going to take my Rev Air Mister and spritz my hair generously with water. Not to the point where it's dripping wet, but just so that it's wet. And now I'm going in with my heat protectant by Tresemme. And all the products that I'm using in this video will be down in the description box. Okay, so I'm just using my fingers at this point. I got my phone and I'm going to use it to time because we're doing 60 seconds. I'm so scared you guys okay now I heard that this is loud I don't know how loud it's gonna be we'll see okay guys wait 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 <laughs> I'm not ready for this I am not ready for this okay Okay, so this is what my hair looks like. I think what I'm gonna do is do high heat speed three because you can still see like texture in my hair, which is not what I'm going for. I'm going for a blowout. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait. You guys, why does my hair look straight? What the heck? Oh my gosh. You guys, my hair looks like it's been straightened. It is a little bit tangled, and I'm assuming that's because I did not use a brush or a comb. Okay? But I think I found my setting. High heat, speed three. Wow. I am kind of speechless right now. So again, I'm just following the same exact process, spritzing my hair with some water, applying my heat protectant, lightly finger detangling, and then feeding my hair into the Rev Air. And since I'm using the Rev Air twice on each section, I would say it took me about 10 minutes to complete this side of my hair. I 
also I wanted to show you guys how smooth sleek shiny and detangled my hair was after using the Rev Air and mind you this is with no tools prior to using this device so this was pretty amazing I think you guys get the gist of what I'm doing by now but I'm just spritzing each section with some water and then my heat protectant lightly finger detangling and then just putting the Rev Air up to my hair and it pretty much just zaps it inside and look at that beautiful I'm still trying to process the fact that I just blow dried my hair. Just looking at my hair, how it looks, the length, I'm just trying to take it all in. And then the Rev Air, it's like too much is going on right now. As for results, these are my results, you guys, and I could not be happier. I feel like this is a reverse hair dryer. It's a blow dryer, and it gave me a blown out look. Actually, a little bit straighter. As for usability, so this is is actually very easy to use it's very scary like when you first see it and like just the wand the base like it's a lot the holes it's just very different once I got over to this side I pretty much got the hang of it and I was good I wasn't scared anymore now with that I will say that this is heavy so after a while of using it your arms will get tired from holding it because it does all the work that kind of cancels out how heavy it is because all you have to do is really hold it while it's doing everything else this is very good if you have fine hair high porosity hair hair that is just prone to damage color treated hair if you are transitioning and you want to blow dry your hair or straighten it when they say that the rev air uses half the amount of heat that traditional blow dryers use i believe them i feel like it was very gentle like a healthier option if you are trying to blow dry your hair so if you guys are interested in the rev air definitely check down below they do have where you can put your email and you'll get an alert once the rev air comes back in stock in 2020 so now i'm gonna film my other video now if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up comment down below feel free to share this video and of course subscribe i'll see you all in the next one bye guys